Targets and sources are powerful complementary utility devices made for routing and combining modulations in every possible way. Targets can take a modulation signal and map it up to six different destinations at once, each with its own set of parameters, allowing for splitting and consistent movements across the live set. In the absence of a mapped modulation signal, it can also act as a super macro knob to control different parameters at the same time. Sources can take up to three different modulation signals and combine them, carrying out math operations and DSP processing between them, generating a resulting signal that can then be mapped to any other parameter. This helps creating complex envelopes starting from any modulation device, regardless of its simplicity. Targets consist of six identical rows. Each target can be mapped independently and it has a set of parameters to sculpt its respective output signal in different ways. On the rightmost side of the device, a set of moving cursors is used to visualize each respective modulation output value. The delay tab is for delaying the signal by a percentage value in relation to the project's tempo settings starting from a time resolution that is global and can be set in the upper drop-down menu of the tab. The Transform tab is for modifying the waveform when it exceeds the oscillation boundary of 1. The transformation modes available are Clip, which clips the value and holds it at 1, Fold, which mirrors the exceeding portion of the waveform upside down. And Wrap, which transposes the exceeding portion of the signal to its lower range. Beside the mode selector, there's the gain parameter, which can be used to amplify the waveform and obtain more radical transformations. Bend is for bending the signal exponentially or logarithmically if its value is above or below 1, respectively. Sources, on the other hand, is pretty simple and easy to understand. The three dials in the top panel are designed to be mapped to any modulation signal, each one of them with an amplifier that allows to balance them between each other. The signals are combined according to different math operations that can be inserted in between them. Available operations are addition, subtraction, multiplication, division and modulo. The signal path goes left to right, meaning that the result of the operation between the first two signals is then combined with the rightmost one. The block in the upper left part of the oscilloscope is the transform parameter, identical to the one found in targets. 